Hello, you absolute legends. In this question, we're going to discover or calculate how many grams of a gas are present. Because we're talking about gases, we're always talking about the gas constant, 0.0821R was referred to. I believe it's named after a famous pirate. And we also have other quantities of this gas that we had no idea. We know that we have a 32.0 liter container of gas. We know that it's in pressure of 1.1 atm. We know the temperature of the gas, which is 300 degrees Kelvin. And we need to calculate the grams of it. Hold on, pause for a second there. How am I to determine grams? Grams, in previous problems, what we solved for was present as one of the units in our ideal gas constant. In this example, we are asking for grams. Aha. Do you remember this? Do you remember how the molecular weight of every element on the periodic table has the units grams per mole? Do you remember how CO2 is something we can look up and add up? on the periodic table. And when we add up all the elements for CO2, we get 44 grams per mole. So that's what we're gonna start our scaffold with. We want our final answer in units, we want our final answer in grams. This is a number about CO2 that contains the unit we're looking for and a unit we quote unquote have. Now we have started our scaffold and now we need to cancel out each unit one at a time. Our first job is to cancel out moles. Moles is at the bottom here and I gotta use this to cancel out moles. Moles come from here and moles cancel out here. I gotta flip this so that way moles is in the numerator up top Notice that I am taking the whole thing, kit and caboodle, and flipping it so that way top unit cancels out bottom unit. Now I need the Kel now I need to make the other stuff cancel out. So let's start with uh, making Kelvin cancel out. Okay, 300 Kelvin. Good, I don't have to do any temperature conversions. It's just K to K. liters, 32 liters. And finally, pressure, 1.1 atm. That's going to go up on top to make top cancel out bottom. This problem had an unusual start to it because we were looking for something in grams and we haven't used the molecular masses or molecular weights recently. But this still fits with our idea of how to do scaffolding, where we make every unit cancel until everything in our shopping list is used up and what we're looking for is the only thing left. I hope this helps. Thank you.